Hello, this is Dr. Day with Innovation Dermatology. Do you have problems with enlarged pores, fine lines and wrinkles, or acne scarring, but don't want the downtime of traditional lasers, which can be up to multiple weeks? Well, if you have any of those issues, then perhaps a treatment you'd want to consider would be medical microneedling. What is it? Microneedling is a new concept that harnesses the body's regenerative capacity to help deal with enlarged pores, fine lines, and scarring. How does it do this? Generally, what we do is we take a device that creates a very controlled injury to the skin. Now, that sounds terrible, but the answer is this. When the skin is injured, the body then deposits components that we want in the skin, like collagen and elastin, and that actually improves skin tone in time. The nice thing about microneedling is it's done in such a way that it is controlled. You can control the level of healing response, whether that's superficial around the eyes, whether that's mid-dermis for the cheeks, or whether it's quite a bit deeper for deep acne scars. And the major benefit of this treatment option is that it's safe for all skin types. Whereas before a lot of the resurfacing lasers could only be used in lighter skin types, Medical microneedling can be used across every skin type imaginable. The other thing that's important about it is it has minimal downtime, which makes it an option that's available for people who have very tight schedules. These are a few questions that we've had from some of our patients, and I just wanted to go through some of those answers about this procedure. The first major question we get is, is this painful? Microneedling all over my face? This sounds terrible. And the answer is generally not. Why? Because we use a numbing cream. If you're all right with us using a numbing cream, you'll experience very little pain at, if any at all. The next question we have is downtime. People who say, you know what, I do want to tighten my pores. I do want to improve fine lines and wrinkles on my face or improve acne scarring. But I've got a busy job. I, I can't have a week off of work. The nice thing about the downtime with this procedure is it is minimal. When I talk about downtime, I'd usually break it into a few steps. The first step is this, after the procedure, generally speaking, I wouldn't recommend you plan any major events right after the procedure. Why? Because you'll have a little pinpoint bleeding, you may have a little bit of bruising, a little bit of swelling. That will last for a day or two and then will be better. So we like to think of it as a rejuvenating Friday procedure where you've got the weekend before you're back to work on Monday. Another thing that's important to realize is that about one week, your skin is look, gonna look smoother, it's gonna look more radiant, and it's gonna be a bit tighter. At about one to two months, that's where you'll start to see that real effect where the body is depositing collagen and elastin that it's doing from a healing response. And so that's where you'll start to see tightening of fine lines, tightening of pores as well. So how many treatments are required is the next follow-up question. The treatments will vary depending on the, the depth of the condition. So if it's acne scarring, quite profound, that may be five or six treatments. If it's just to tighten up pores, improve fine lines and wrinkles, within two or three treatments, you may achieve the results that you're looking for. But a lot of the time, those, those treatments are spaced one to two months apart. So you'll be able to determine, are you achieving what you're looking for with one, two, three, four treatments? And then we'd kind of go from there. So hopefully that answers those questions that you have about this exciting treatment option. And we look forward to seeing you soon at Innovation Dermatology. Remember, you only have one skin.